Chain Finance, and this is a stock update on DFEN or Direction Daily Aerospace and Defense Bull ETF. Now it is down 1% today and down 5.26% in the past week and then up 0.36% in the past month. Um, it is very undervalued. It is a three times leverage ETF, but before COVID crash, it was 71.43. Right now it is 16.56. Um, through the month, that month high, it was 18.08, 18.11. Um, so truly with it being one and a half dollars down, um, I'd say now is a pretty good time to buy in pretty lightly. If it does go down, another two three percent definitely a little bit more um five percent definitely just keep pounding away at that because eventually with COVID 19 vac vaccinations being released into the public um throughout the world canada france united states um air travel is going to be a lot more open and accessible to the public even before um, COVID. There's a lot of airports being built right now. Um, a lot of new aerospace technology that's coming out. New, uh, with that technology, battery powered airplanes. Uh, it's pretty new. But yeah, all around, this is a great sector that is honestly undervalued just from the lack of recognition and just people thinking oh, the aerospace sector is just slowly fading, which in fact is just increasing every single year. About 1.2 million people are using air travel than they were the previous year. So it's growing at a crazy rate. Um, but other than that, just, just keep getting into DFEN. Direction and daily aerospace and defense bull ETF. Three times leverage, it's a little bit more risky. The the fees, it's 1.62% in um, yearly maintenance fee. But I mean, the returns are insane. So when it opened May 5th, 2017, and before the COVID drop off, it was up almost 200%. It was 184 which is great, but keep in mind it is a three times leverage ETF. So there's a decay feature. It'll go down a lot more than it'll go up uh, normally. But because the US stock market likes to trend up, it's gonna trend up eventually. So that's about it. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one.